Hey everybody, welcome back to Overland Florida. As you guys know, I got a brand new Ford Maverick and in the back of my Ford Maverick, I have a brand new refrigerator. So I'm finally gonna show it to you guys. I've had a lot of comments in the uh, YouTube videos of camping with my uh, my new truck and I'm finally gonna go over it and show you guys, tell you how to get one if you want one. We'll start with the outside first, but uh, answer some questions. When it is running, I'm drawing about 50, no more than 50, between like 48 50 less 52 um, watts when it's running so I know you, a lot of you guys ask those questions so I just want to show you right there in person but this refrigerator is pretty unique it's the only one that I know that's like reflective kind of like stainless steel on the outside and uh, one thing we did notice the last time we went camping with this this thing actually runs less because this actually reflects the heat um, all the other refrigerators that are plastic and molded plastic and black and stuff like that they just soak up the heat and those things are so hot to the touch um, even when you're camping and they just seem to run a lot so this one is when it's in the sun it's cool to the touch usually and I noticed it doesn't run as often as the other refrigerator so that's a huge plus right there in itself so maybe since Bodega has these uh, refrigerators like this maybe other companies will start making them like this as well but uh, Bodega does a really good job so far quality wise so on the right side over here, you have some wheels, so you can roll this on the ground. You have nice spring-loaded handles right here, all metal, really strong. Uh, the lock system is really nice. You actually have keys. These actually lock. So I can leave this in the bed of my truck. I can lock it to the bed through one of these nice, strong steel handles so nobody will steal it. And then I can also lock it with a key so no one can uh, take anything from inside the refrigerator. And it also helps with critters. A lot of animals, raccoons, and stuff like that can actually open up latches and get inside refrigerators. So this helps as well. <clears throat> so this refrigerator runs off 12 volt like a socket, just like this, or you can run it off 110 uh, through a plug at the house. So uh, I generally use the 12 volt plug, it works just fine. This refrigerator is dual zone, so it's really dusty. This thing's been in my truck since I got it. Um, so you can adjust the temperature on each side. You can also adjust um, the power level. So if you want to use, you know, the low setting of the battery that you can power this off of, if you're using a 12 volt battery, um, you can set the battery level. So if you want the refrigerator to shut off at a certain voltage, that way you still have power um, on the main battery to start your vehicle. Um, of course, you got your settings, you got your power, and you got the LCD screen right here that tells you everything you need to know. So let's go ahead and open up this bad boy. Got two nice latches right here. A nice heavy, not too heavy, but a nice heavy as in quality lid. And you got a big rubber seal right here. And the nice thing about this, this actually has a lip. A lot of the, a lot of the other refrigerators don't have a lip. They just have a little tiny rubber seal. This lip actually comes down and covers that. That's how big this lip is. So it gives you a lot of protection and also creates a really nice seal and uh, keeps a lot of that cold air in. So I like the, definitely like the lid on this one. You also have nice uh, steel cable limiting straps right here. So those are nice stainless steel. Of course, you got stainless steel hardware as well. So they're nice and strong. All right, so you generally you're going to have a freezer side over here, which you can adjust the temperature to a low setting for, uh, you know, meats and ice cream and whatever you want. That's going to be significantly significantly colder than anything else and over here you have like the refrigerator side you can even use both of these as a freezer side you can set both temperatures really low if you want you know entire um, refrigerator of just freezer stuff so that's pretty nice as well you got an LED light right here on this side it's pretty bright you got another LED light right here it opens up as soon as you open up the lid on the refrigerator comes on um, you have two baskets right here you can lift makes cleaning and everything easier you also have a drain on one side and a drain on the other side so you can rinse it out you don't have to dump it out you can just rinse it out in place and it'll drain out the bottom or if you have a spill in there and you want to spill or get all the uh the nasty uh refrigerator juices that are down inside of there you can take those out really easily other than that there's not much to say one thing i really do like about this it also comes with an app so you can have this in the back of a camper you can have this in another room of where you're living you can have this in the back the bed of your truck and you can have an app on your phone and you can monitor 
the temperature of the refrigerator. You can also change the temperatures of the refrigerator and change all the settings that you can on this screen. You can also change on the app on your phone. So it's really nice. You can be in the bed, of your, you can have this in the bed of your truck, you can be in the cab and you can turn it off if it's using too much power. You can turn it back on in the morning. Um, you can do whatever you want through an app just on your phone and it connects really nice. I've never had an issue with it connecting or anything. But this is the Bodega 45 quart. They do have other size refrigerators and other models. Um, this is the one they sent me and I'm very happy with it. Um, this probably will be the refrigerator that I keep in the bed of my truck. Um, I have a Ford Maverick, the bed's pretty small, and this refrigerator isn't very tall. It's still 45 quarts, so you can pack a lot of stuff in there. But I think the dimensions on this refrigerator are gonna work really well with um, the size of the bed that I have in this Ford Maverick. So if you guys have any questions or you want to check out the price or discount codes or anything like that, in the description of this video, I will have all that information listed. Again, this is a Bodega 45-quart dual-zone refrigerator.